Just look at the terrible shape this dog is in. It weighs about seven pounds when it should be about three times that. Her condition has animal shelter volunteers in San Marcos heartbroken, but also determined to help her survive and to find out how this happened. Molly Oak has the story. It's a place filled with fun in the sun. Even one pups can enjoy. Rio Vista Park was also where a disturbing discovery was made. She was covered in fleas and she had ticks in her ears. No tags, no microchip. The internet has sort of deemed, given her the name Faith. Faith was dropped off at the San Marcos Regional Animal Shelter Monday afternoon. In the photos, you can see everything. You can see her whole skeletal frame. The image is tough to forget. It was... It was intense, <laughs> especially for Lauren Volpe. She was just very, very thin, very frail, but she just immediately came up to me and started trying to give me kisses. And just to see that, I got a little emotional. Working at the shelter, Volpe sees a lot of abandoned and abused animals. This, at least for me, was a unique experience. You know, going into the kennel, I actually had to take a moment to collect myself seeing her. That's, that's very rare. But even with Faith's frail and fragile body. She's just so sweet the entire time and almost playful. She just wanted somebody to love on her and play with her. That's what gives Volpe hope. Dogs are incredibly resilient and they're also just very naturally loving animals. So a lot of times you'll see dogs that are in very bad conditions, but they, it's almost as if they don't realize it and all they want is, is love and affection. Faith that a dog bearing the same name will recover. She does. She feels better too. In San Marcos, Molly Oak, KVU News Nightbeat. Now this is an open investigation. The shelter is trying to figure out who this dog belonged to. If you have any information that might help, please give the shelter a call. That info is on KV.com right now.